What's going on? This is Jason from G-Style Magazine, and we are back again. And today we are talking about the Google Pixel Buds 2 and why I personally had to buy these. So by now, at the time of this video, the Google, the Google Pixel Buds 2 should be available in all colors, which kind of sucks because when I purchased mine, I probably would have got the almost black because a lot of the color choices that I choose to skew towards that black gray hue. But the clearly white was all that was available at the time, which I guess in hindsight is perfectly fine because it matches up real nicely with the clearly white Pixel 4 XL I have. So I, it's grown on me, but I definitely would have probably chose the all black hue if you know I had the option. But I digress. You know, as you can see, I'm super excited to pick these up. And you know, so I went up, went ahead and picked them up on day one. And by now you've seen a ton of reviews about the Google Pixel Buds. So I'm not really gonna talk about so much a review of them. If you kind of see if you kind of want to see a review on it, I'll link you in the description below to the main site article where I wrote up my thoughts about the Google Pixel Buds. But the main thing I want to talk about today is the main reason I probably picked these up and that's the Google Assistant inside the Google Pixel Buds. Like my review of the Google Pixel 4 XL, I talk about how Google's hardware is okay, it's decent, but it's the software where Google pretty, one, pretty much knocks it out and that's pretty much the reason why I wanted to pick up these Google Pixel Buds. Yes, the Google Pixel Buds look good and the case does too. Yes, the sound quality is good. Yes, bass is not leaves much to be desired, but it's still doable. And yes, the battery life is in the class leading. But when you get to the Google Assistants, yes, this is where Google shines, and this is why I wanted these headphones, earbuds, I should say. And let's talk about why and what you can do with Google Assistants inside the Google Pixel Buds. Okay, so the Google Pixel Bud and what you can do with Google Assistant. So yes, you can use these as earbuds, work with any Android device, sounds good, I love them. But Google Assistant is so cool in these things, you know, cause my thing is I just don't want to have to pick up my phone all the time if I don't have to. So with Google Assistant, there's a variety of things you can do with it. Some of my favorites include, you know, you can use your Google Assistant to make phone calls and send, and send text messages without ever touching your phone. Tap of the button and make your phone call. Then you can also, you know, you can go check out music. You can not only ask Google to play the music that you want to hear, but you can pause, play, hit next track, previous track, rewind or fast forward a specific amount of time, all that without even having to pick up your phone to do it. Beautiful, excellent, I love it. You also can check the weather or time without ever having to pick up your phone. No need Bust to unlock it. Go to the weather app. You just simply new Windsor today, tap the air, ask Google what the time is, or what's the weather for the day. Or even touch, you know, you can even ask what your schedule is for the day. You know, you never need to actually touch your phone. And then another feature that I like, and probably one of my favorites with Google Assistant and the Google Pixel Buds, is so I have a. 2017 Chevy Cruze and you know I have the whole Sirius Connect uh, my Chevy whatever you want to call it but I can simply tap my ear and ask Google to ask, ask Chevrolet, Chevrolet to, start my, to start my car or to unlock my car got it to stop starting your Chevrolet Cruze you know, that right there is pretty cool when you know you're getting ready for the day and you know you want to pre-warm your car or pre-cool it if it's hot in the summer you can ask Google right from your earbuds to start your car and you're pretty much ready to go. Um, beyond that, I mean, there's a whole host of things you can do with the Google Pixel Buds 2 without ever needing to touch your phone. And that was kind of one of the main selling points because, you know, like I said, it's a decent pair of headbuds. You know, love, I love this case. I love that little clicking sound, you know, really cool. but. The Google Assistant inside this has really put this on that next level for me. 
and was one of the main reasons why I um, wanted to pick it up. So, right, like I said, right now Google Pixel Buds 2 is available in all the colors. It's going for about $179. You can get it at the Google Store. Um, or I'm pretty sure a bunch of other retailers. Um, I'm not sure if they have it on Amazon. You know what? I'll research that for you. And by the time this video airs, I'll have that in the description below. But before I go, don't forget, if you like this video, like and subscribe and click that bell button so you, that way you're going to be notified whenever we put up new videos. I'm going to go for now. Jace Anson, G-Style Magazine. Quick, quick video because I just love and I had to talk about it. Take care.